Do you know guys why you are seeing this video after 8 days of break? Yes, it's because I was really busy working on it from the last week or so. Now I'm going to share all the stuff which I, I have been researching and it is the, also the total outcome of my lifetime experience in 3D. I'm going to share it with you guys in a few minutes. Sounds interesting? So I would like you guys to watch it carefully and don't skip anything because it's really important to not do. First of all, a bit introduction for those who don't have a clear concept for 3D animation. So what actually is 3D animation? It's the process of generating moving image of three dimensional objects in a digital environment. In simple terms, animating objects that appear in a three dimensional space digitally. Animation is important because it makes us able to tell stories and communicate emotion and ideas in a unique and easy way that both children and adults can understand it and enjoy. Animation is not only used to entertain their audience, it's also used to the audience to understand the world better. Do you know guys what, what was the first ever full length animated movie? Yeah, it was Toy Story. Toy Story was the first to make history as a 3D animation film. And do you know guys what was the most revenue generated movie ever? In early 2018, Disney Studio released its famous animated movie Frozen 2, which became the highest grossing animated release globally of all the time with estimate earning up 1.82 billion, beating the record set by its Frozen 1, which was 1.281 billion dollar and incredible 2 which was 1.243 billion dollars this was some general knowledge next let's take a quick view at these 12 steps which are used to create a 3d animated movie there are probably more steps to produce 3d animation than you think there are the process of 3d animation pipeline is complex and can be a lot more complicated than any other form of animation the steps we read from project to project and also each animation studio has its own approach towards producing a 3D animation movie. Depending on what project and which 3D animation movie studio is involved, the number of steps may be read. But these 11 are the most common steps involved in producing a 3D animation movie. Number 1. Concept and Storyboard the very first step in producing a 3D animation movie is the storyboard that translates the I these ideas into visual form. The storyboard is a sequence of illustration that showcases your digital story in two dimensions. In this step, we create a rough idea that what will happen first, next and last. We use Illustrator most of the time for creating concept or storyboard. Number 2. 3D Modeling after the storyboard are finished and approved by its client, the task of building and props, environment and characters begin. The proper terms are called modeling. It's the process where we convert our concept into three-dimensional objects. We use many softwares for creating 3D models like Blender, Maya, 3D Max, Houdini and more. When a 3D model is created, 2D image can be overlaid on it to add colors, designs and texture. This process is called te texturing. Number 4. Rigging Rigging is the process to set up controllable skeleton for the character that is in intended for animation. Depending on what, depending on the subject matter, every rig is unique. In simple terms, we add some controllable points to animate it easily. Number 5. Animation Animation is the process of taking a 3D object and getting it to move. There are different type of animation like keyframe animation where we add movement to our character frame by frame. Second one is the path animation where we add a path for an object to follow. And the most advanced way is the motion capture where we add real life videos and make our object to get movement data from it. Number 6. Lightning Lighting in 3D world is just as essential as it is in real life. Same like real life, when we shot a movie and set up light, we also do the same thing in 3D. Set up light like area lights, point lights and sunlight and so on. Number 7. Camera setting. Same like lighting, this step is also very essential as it in real. 
In addition software, camera has no size or weight. You can move the camera to any location and even inside. You can also animate camera so that several operations like place at once such as amazing zooming into a scene while changing the depth of field. Once you create a camera in 3D, you can pick a view and assign the view in the view of camera meaning that you will see the scenes from the perspective of the camera. Number 8. Rendering Rendering an image is typically the last step in the 3D production pipeline but not the last step from final output. In this stage, we create a good final renders of a scene, including attention to the camera placement, lighting choice, which may affect mode and shadows, reflection and transparency, and the handling of special effects like fluid. Number 9. Composition and Special VFX The renders are brought into composition program to edit, touch up, and add a special effect. Composition include everything for what you probably normally think of as a special effects. Where things explode, magic happen, and sci-fi and so on. Number 10. Voice over and music. In this step, we add music and voice over to our animation. Sometimes there are different type of props like carpenters, plates, glasses, chairs. The pulley artist can replace original sounds completely or existing sound to create a richer track. Number 11 Editing and Final Output This is where it ends. This is where the composite render out, out cut out some scenes and get the final output so that's it. Hope you guys like the video. If you like then give me a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more interesting videos. For now, bye.